don't you worry, child. Mm -hmm. I'm very excited. Mm -hmm. Roomy? 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 <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, so it is move in day, move out and move in day. Here we are. Here we are. I cannot believe that I am leaving this house. Like honestly, it was such a huge chapter of my life, you know? Um, I just have so many emotions right now. It's just, it's, it's emotional, you know? So anyways, let me show you guys around. By far the, the hardest move of my entire life. Like it was just such a huge house with guest rooms and, all my, you know, since I'm running a business from home, just my inventory alone was just crazy. I have some extra clothes here that didn't fit in my bins. But yes, yeah, so everything's packed up. And see the dressers. We've got suitcases. All that stuff. Um, I kind of left like the, uh, all the furniture that the guys are going to pick up. I actually have movers coming in an hour. We got the big TV down. And um, they're just going to like put everything in trucks because I just need help with that for sure. <laughs> So this is my personal stuff. Let me just let me just record this for Mems because I love this house so much. It was just such a pleasure living here. You know, loved it. This is my office, so it's definitely like really different now that there's not all the plants and the the boho stuff. But uh, yeah, then we have here. This is where I used to like meditate and everything with the wall. I had to take down all the plants and the lights and all that stuff. So inventory over there. Also, like this was like my packing station, so this is a huge little um, area where everything was organized and nicely. And we're moving over here, and that's where it gets a little crazy. Okay, we got guest room, so they're gonna come move the bed and everything. Uh, I have inventory in there as well, but we've got inventory. Uh, guest bathroom. We got some laundries going on right now. This one is completely cleared out as well. Um, Nick still has a bunch of like impact stuff that I like put neatly so that was also like a lot of work for him to come pick up but we have all this and then we got the guest room over there with my um my little display thing and then, uh and then yeah basically i mean i'm not gonna show you guys everything but it's just been freaking hectic just clearing out all these shelves and packing up all my inventory and labeling everything and i'm such an idiot at first i started doing this you know like in actual boxes but i ran out so i ended up getting uh clear ones and i realized it's so much easier because now like when you guys place orders i don't have to go through this entire pile of just boxes and look for the sizes i can just see what's in there so i wish that i did that from the beginning, if you guys have offices, um, I mean businesses at home, I definitely recommend doing that. It's just a lot easier. But yeah, and I'm about to empty out these boxes that kind of like exploded into these bins right now. Oh man, this is so crazy. Hey guys down, cause I'm shaking so much. I'm exhausted. Like I've been packing for like three days, four days straight. I mean, I started like a month ago already like clearing things out just cause I had so many things. Um, but actually like putting them in boxes and everything. I didn't leave the house in like two three days So I am so tired. So anyways, Justin made me try a double espresso this morning that I just chugged because I hate coffee I never drink coffee hate the taste hate the smell. So I am I'm wired right now uh, But yeah, so the movers are on the way Justin came to pick up Cora and Echo and bring them to his house um, Just because like the doors are gonna be open in the garage and stuff. We don't want them running around so This is it this is it, new chapter, new life. So yeah, so the movers are on the way right now just to kind of like help me um, with the big stuff, like the furniture, the beds, the everything that I have. It's couch TVs, um, a big leader outside, my egg chair. They have to kind of like disassemble everything and I did not, I did not want to do that again, okay? There's absolutely no way. If you guys are doing a big move like that, I highly recommend getting movers. I just found out that I could have um, <clears throat> hired Packers, I think that's what they call that actually pack your stuff for you. So a little too late for that, but I would, I think I would have done that because <laughs> my back, I'm like walking like a 70 year old. <laughs> I'm just dying. I'm exhausted. But okay, anyways, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna finish clearing out the fridge, all the like last minute things, and then we're gonna clear this house out. I will give you guys a little tour once it's empty, just because it's gonna hit me in the feels. Like I just, I just know it. Um, and then I'll show you guys my new place, my new, my new life. Okay, see you. I mean, 
I don't think there's any way that we can fit all my stuff in in just just one truck. Like what? <laughs> what? Yeah, never mind. It's 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 quite large when you look at it from the side. <laughs> I'm gonna get us some smoothies because it is just so hot. And I'm gonna surprise them with it because it's gonna be so nice. Movers couldn't um, unmount some of my beds, so they sent me here to get an Allen wrench. But I have no idea what I'm doing, so <laughs> I'm just gonna get the full pack. <laughs> Hopefully there's one in there. <laughs> that was insane. But look at how crazy. So the house is completely empty. This is so weird. Actually, Nick still has a few things, um, a little like inventory and stuff. So he's gonna come pick it up. But for the most part, it's, um, that's it. Here we are. Here we are. Look at how crazy. My office is without anything. It's not even an office. <laughs> okay guys, well, this is super emotional, honestly. I actually remember the very first YouTube video uh, when we first moved in, being in this room like this, and it was echoing so much because there's like, there's nothing and it kind of looked very similar. So, <sighs> all right, new chapter. Goodbye house, thank you for all these amazing memories. <laughs> okay. See ya. Goodbye, little home. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> Ladies and gents, I have arrived. <laughs> I've arrived. <laughs> Wait, where the fuck's the truck? Well, that's not good. <laughs> this is our first night here. First time watching the sunset with this new beautiful view. Real. Are you adjusting well, Michelle? <laughs> Hello, friends. Okay, so it's the next day. I wanted to kind of record the rest of the whole like moving day yesterday, but it was so crazy. So the movers came at like 1130 and then they booked the whole move until 5 p.m. And we didn't finish unloading the last box until I think it was like 8 p.m. or 830. So it was like eight hour, nine hour uh, full of just of loading my stuff and unloading it, like not even like unpacking anything. So I was exhausted, hadn't slept for days, literally. So this is the next day and I'm officially moved in. All my boxes are here. I got a good night's sleep. I'm so excited. I've been living like a freaking nomad, just nothing anywhere, just a couple socks here, a couple underwear there. Um, so today I'm just going to start unpacking some stuff and organizing a little bit i think i'm going to focus first like my, all my clothes everything is in just big bins but honestly it's not really what i'm worried about right now i just want to like get back to work get back to your orders and you know just get that sorted out so i'm gonna go ahead and fix up the two rooms i'm just so excited to start selling it so i'm gonna show you guys around how it is now and then hopefully i can get some stuff done later i'm excited so today i'm just gonna focus on my two offices because i can so I can start like, you know, working right away and pack your orders and stuff. So this will be my actual office with my setup desk, my treadmill, I put like pretty lights and maybe like all my plants that were in the other house, um, my little boho display. And then here will actually be my packing station. So we have a desk over there. I'll set up the printer. I'm gonna put the map up. Uh, my rack with all my samples will be here. So, I mean, I think this is the plan for now. But yeah, this is the before. Can't wait to show you guys the after. Are you excited, Justin? Where are you? <laughs> okay, this is the new walk for the plans. Day two of being roomies. How does it feel having this schmuck up all up in your face? No, huh? uh, is it nice? It's better than I thought. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah. Well, that's yeah. nice. You exceeded, exceeded expectations. <laughs> so far. We'll With my schmuckness. <laughs> yeah, it's only day two. <laughs> Okay, here we are hours later. So this is what I've done so far. So this is my 
first office. It's still kind of like messy. There's boxes everywhere. Uh, but I have my stand-up desk with my little treadmill. I don't know where I'm going to hang this up yet. But I did my little display with little butterflies. All the creations that I've created since the start of Little Sunshine Boutique. Um, actually, I just put in the nails right now to put the backdrop with all the lights and the leaves. So that'll be a really cool background for when I do hauls and stuff, like with the natural lights. So here we are. And then we're walking in here. This is actually... Hi, Michelle! <laughs> so this is my packing station slash kind of like display with all of my samples. I really like it. Very simple. Uh, very nice. We put up the map. I got this like little boho uh, shelves to put my jewelry in so that I don't have to, to actually leave the packing station for the little stuff, you know? And then the back is like all my inventory in the garage. But here we go with the little boho. I do want to put these lights up um, at some point. I don't know when yet. Uh, but yeah, so this is, it actually fits perfectly with my little printer right here. So the orders actually come out and it's perfect. I got my little, my little packaging bags right here my thank you notes fit right in here like what this is so cool and organized right go, go. so then you walk in here and we have the kitchen so there's still like bins everywhere and stuff we're not done uh we're not done at all actually hi cute uh but yeah so this is the kitchen we got two little islands with our ghost a little pantry right here, all the supplements. So we actually finished the living room for the most part. We still got like a few things coming, but look how cute. We got the lights up over there. The couch, I put my little boho, a little tray right here. We got the massive mirror, some floating shelves over there with some plants. We do want to find something cool to put up there, but we did put this bookshelf together and it looks so good. Like this is so cool. And actually these LED lights change at nights with these as well. So you can like change the vibe and it's just super cozy. We're loving it. And then outside, we haven't like done that yet. This is probably gonna be like a next project, but I just wanted to show you guys. So my extra is right there. Uh, we kind of want to redo the deck and everything, but yeah, this is it for now. Not bad for one day, honestly, not, uh, not bad at all. So basically here, the, the last thing that we want to do is put off one more shelf, but we're waiting for like, I bought some really big brown baskets to put uh, all of the like pillows and the covers, but I'll like match, I'll be like a darker brown. And then one that closes right here for all the dog toys. So it'll be like really nice and contrasted. So this is basically done. So now next project is, it's not like clothes everywhere. Uh, we're going to hang this up right here and then our master bedroom. So I haven't done anything here yet. I still have all my clothes in just bins and stuff, but it's pretty cool. I did put up uh, little plants because that was the priority, honestly. But we're pretty nice setup. So those are my dressers. I still have to fill them up. I have my little vanity over here with all my makeup. Uh, so I clear this out. We're going to hang some really cool plants on the wall and stuff. And then this is our master bathroom, I guess you could say, with the shower. I still have to unpack all my stuff. Uh, but yeah, this is uh, basically it, guys. I just bought these like really cool bins right here. So I have to like organize all of that as well. And then my closet, I did go ahead and fill out this little section with just my gym clothes just because like I needed to get dressed other than just from my suitcase. <laughs> so I only have like my sports bra, shorts, and leggings for now. But I'm going to add like my bags, my shoes. And uh, just basically all my bow dresses. It's going to be a lot, a lot of work. <laughs> okay, so we just built the shelves. I made a little, a little walkway. I might have to get more. I'm not sure, but I'm going to unpack all my inventory. And uh, this will be my next project right now. So that everything is nicely lined up in every size and color. And I can pack your orders. Let's do it. So that, my friends, is basically it for the first few days of moving in. I think we're moving pretty fast, honestly. Uh, like I said, my offices are basically done. I cannot wait to show you next video uh, how we actually just finish up this whole place. I think it's going to be so cute and so cozy. I already love it. I feel super just 
grounded and just like in my groove like literally the first day i set up my office and i was already like packing orders and just like feeling really really productive so i'm just so excited to take you guys on this journey but let me know what else you guys want to see i can't wait to get back onto youtube i've been saying that for a while but i feel like my life would just constantly like crazy shit happening back to back and trips and there's just there was just no way so we are back hope you guys are as excited as i am and i hope that you enjoyed this video